Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our live stream today and thank you very much for joining. Yes. My name is Markus Reisig and I'm managing director of Citizen Machinery Germany. And it's a pleasure for me to, uh, to start today for, for this event. Uh, we had, uh, we are now in a very, very strange time. Since about one year, we are living behind the Corona pandemic. Uh, we had the crisis. Uh, we had no traveling, no exhibitions, no meetings. It's very, very pity. But on the other hand, from l end of last year, the economy is getting better and better. And it, it seems that the economy is very strong against the Corona virus. So together we have to go ahead and have to do our best to, for, for our future. So today we concentrate on two models, two Miano models, the ANX and the BNE. And we will start at first in English version. Adlen Trabelsi will take, will take care for the English version. Later on, Oliver Loth for the German version. And I have to say thank you to all for all for the preparation. And here behind the camera for, for manage everything to Sasha and Melanie and also for the technical side for Jakob to prepare the machine. Uh, and we can really proud of these two new models. You will see later on by Adlen and Oliver. And now we can start. Please listen, please watch, give us your questions and opinions and later on check in your office at home your work pieces and think about how to make these work pieces. And I am sure most of case our best solution will be our very, very good models. So please enjoy the, the live stream. See you soon, maybe next time again on this channel and take care and stay safe. Bye bye. So good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome also from my side to our live stream. We are today in our citizen showroom in Fillingendorf. Fillingendorf is a small, lovely uh, village in the Black Forest area in the south of Germany. My name is Adlen Trabelsi and I am very pleased to introduce you today two new citizen machines from the type fixed head. Behind me, the first one, as Mr. Isaac mentioned, the ANX 42 SYY. Um, first, uh, before to start the technical points, I want to give you a message about the ANX. The ANX will not meet only the demand of our traditional Miano end users, which is mostly high quality, high rigidity and precision. The ANX will also meet the demand of our Syncom customers, which is mostly nothing else than speed, productivity and short cycle time. First, a short uh, explanation about the machine name. So Citizen give this new machine the name ANX. 42 is showing the spindle passage. So we have two spindles in the machine with a, with a, with a passage of 42 millimeter. SYY means S subspindle, double Y axis in both turrets. I will move to this side to uh, let you have a view on our work area. Uh, the configuration of the machines to so my side and the left side. Maybe you I hope you can see it. We will show you the graphic or yes. Yeah, thank you, Sasha. Uh, in the left side, we have in the middle the main spindle. By the way, the main spindle has a power of 11 kilowatt with 6000 RPM. In the upper side, we have the turret number one and the lower side, the turret number two. Moving to the other side, we have the back spindle, also with the same performance, means 11 kilowatt and 6,000 RPM. We have here the standard part catcher. Maybe important information that the standard ANX for Europe will have a, hand, a part catcher hand type. We will have a kind of fingers picking up the parts from the back spindle, moving it to the standard work convoyer. The benefit of the gripper is, of course, less scratches and nearly no scratches on the workpiece by transferring out of the machine. Uh, information about the axis, you can see the graphic. We have 
in each turret three axes, Z, X and the Y axis. And then we have on the back spindle the Z and the X axis. Now let me um, highlight the, the highlights of the ANX. Why should you consider the ANX for your uh, production line and for your future productivity? The machine has four main characteristics. The ANX is flexible for your future job. The ANX is fast to shorten the cycle time. The ANX is user friendly for your operators. The ANX has now the highlight LV on the turret. We are proud that the LV function is really, in our machine, the first fixed head having LV function on the turret. Uh, starting with the flexibility of the machine, there is also some points to mention. We have two turrets. Each turret has 12 stations, so in the system we have 24 tool positions. This number can easily increase by using double holder or triple holders. Uh, also important to know that uh, the quick change system, CAPTO C3, is also available for the ANX. For our Miano customer, I want to add uh, the information that we have here, uh, a, a turret tooling system from the BNA42. Um, you know, the BNA has a small turret with eight station. We have here 12, but it's the same uh, rotary tool system. So now um, moving to the next point of the flexibility, we have two Y axes, giving you and our, uh, the operator the flexibility to produce uh, um, complex parts by using two Y axes simultaneous. The next point showing the flexibility are the two long axes on, on both turrets. We will see it later on uh, by the demo live demo. You will see that the both turret can move to the back spindle and work simultaneous also in both spindle. So we can really decide which turret has to work with which, which spindle. So uh, flexibility is giving mainly, in my opinion, with the available X axis we have here a very long x-axis with 240 millimeter in total from zero up 120 and from zero down 120. It means the operator are always flexible to move the, the, the back spindle out from the interference area. Just an example, when you want to make a deep drilling with the upper turret to the main spindle, so you will need this area. You can move the back spindle down and you still have 120 millimeter to perform back machining with the lower turret without any limitation. Thanks to the x-axis, we can produce very fast, very easy and precisely eccentric parts. We can switch the back spindle down and pick up eccentric parts from the main side. Another advantage, you can also install next to the back spindle a tile stock system supporting long workpieces. This is option and um, example also here you produce a long shaft which needs to be supported. The back spindle will support the workpiece while the two turrets are totally free to work simultaneous on the workpiece. Also a next uh, important point for the x-axis is the super on post function. The super on post function, a short explanation, is working with two, three or four tools together. We will see it in the live demo and also I will explain later more. So that was the point flexibility. Coming now to the point um, fast. Why is the ANX fast? First, because we have both spindle with the built-in motor technology. Maybe you know the built-in motor technology, like in our Swiss type machines, have, have the characteristic for a very short cycle time when acceleration, in this case from eight to 6,000, and very short time for the deceleration down to zero. This will help a lot to reduce the idle time um, then the next point, due and thanks to the two y-axis, we can produce complex parts with the complex milling uh, parallel with two y-axis. Then we have the x-axis allowing the superimpose function. The superimpose function again is, for example, using the turret, the upper turret, to work in both spindle, plus the lower turret working also. So this also will reduce the cycle time dramatically. Without the x-axis, not possible to do. So another point is also the linear axis we have here because of the LFV. We have here linear axis with a um, speed of 24 meter per minute and the long axis Z3 has 30 meter per minute, making the machine faster and more dynamic. 
Also, the turret indexing time is very short. I don't mean indexing from T5 to T6 as an example. I mean uh, the complete macro programming. When the turret is moving out from the workpiece, indexing and coming back. Of course, many customers are using it safe, driving the turret out, indexing safe and back. But there is also macro supporting the fast exchange. So far from the flexibility and from the speed of the ANX, I suggest I, we will show you now a live demonstration. I will start the machine, but in parallel, Zasha will show you also the video for your better visualization. It's the same part running. So. so you can see the super on both function now. Three tooling together, we are now turning, but we can use this process also for thread cutting. Thread cutting with two turrets and three tooling also possible for drilling process. We are machining here stainless steel 4305. So I have a look, yes, now a turning. Now parallel machining. Upper turret in the back spindle, lower turret in the main spindle. Again, the data about the, the, the power of the machine, 11 kilowatt on both spindles. And then we have a 20 Newton meter on the rotary tools. Yep, inside machining. With the inside machining, we will discuss about it also when you're making internal turning, you can have big problems when having um, difficult materials, you will have nasty uh, ships around the tools. So the part catcher, taking the part and out. Now we have some milling performance with two tooling together. The clamping system, what we see now, is the standard clamping system DIN 173 for 42 mm. Of course, we can modify both spindle to Heinbuch system, to three power chuck, to different uh, other chuck systems. So also from the power chuck side, we are very flexible with both spindle. So now a cutoff process. We have a um, special holder for direct uh, mounting the insert. This making the uh, cutoff tool holder very rigid and will also increase the tool life. Okay, done. Cycle is finished, I open the door. So, um, you remember, I mentioned four characteristics, flexibility, speed, user-friendly, and LFV. Now coming to the point user-friendly, why is the ANX user-friendly? First, the smart kinematic. You remember, we mentioned that uh, both turret can work in both spindle. An example, when your operator will set up a part and recognize that the cycle time is too long, he has to switch some machining from the turret one and main spindle to the back spindle to reduce the cycle time. Of course, he has to make the mechanical change of the tool holders, but from the software side, he can just copy the already programmed um, processing in the spindle one to spindle two. Because we have the same spindle performance and the similar turret, we can use this mirror effect and very fast bringing uh, some tooling in the back side. The next point, I will move to this side. The next point, making the machine user-friendly for the operator. The access to the, uh, to the work area. The operator has access to the lower turret and the upper turret very easily. It's comfortable and also help him to set up very fast the machine for a new part. Then having a look on our panorama. This uh, is also in uh, the new generation Miano. We will see it also in the BNE. Big panorama means also comfortable for the visualization for the operator. You know that 
Setting up a new part is a stressful job for the operator when driving a new program. A lot of features in the controller and also this panorama will give him access to see, to see really what happens and, and, and give him also stressless working. So, now about the controller system. We have here a FANO controller uh, type 30E, uh, 31E mode B. Uh, it's a famous controller, easy to handle. A lot of uh, uh, engineers and operators can handle it very easily. But the news with this controller is the screen and the, and the pult of the machine. We have a big screen, colored display with 15 inch with a touch screen function. And we have also the keyboard. It means when the operator will program directly on the machine, he has really the freedom to decide touch screen or keyboard. Um, additional to that, we have the user-friendly macros from Citizen. Many of you know it uh, in our Syncom machines and also in our Miano machines. Um, an example, the superimpose function. The superimpose function using three tools, it looks really very complex. Basically, it's for the operator, not such complex to program. Um, give you a, a view about how to build this kind of program. The operator will make his, um, I will open the door, will make his uh, programming between tool number five with the main spindle. Then he take also the tool number five to the back spindle and make also his processing separately. After both processing are ready, he gives a G code on both lines and the machine know that the, uh, the back spindle, thanks to the X axis, can follow the movement of the turret when machining in the main spindle. This will reduce the cycle time, as you see. And we can also add the lower turret with the same principle, making separately, giving a G code and machine will make it automatically, giving the operator confident, uh, no collusion and also user friendly. So, so far, OK, now coming to our highlight. Our highlight is our LV technology. The LV technology is standard available on the ANX in both turrets, in the Z and X axis. For the ladies and gentlemen who don't know the LV yet, maybe a short information. When you are producing difficult materials with long ships, let's say plastic, nylon, uh, stainless, 3101, titanium or copper, um, maybe the problem with the long ships in the fixed head machine is not dramatically like in our Swiss uh, machine, Swiss type machines. But anyhow, if you make inside turning, threading. Long ships can limit the productivity a lot. Thanks to the LV, you can reduce it. You can, I would say for the operator, when he recognizes that long ships are nesting around the tool, just he, before the tool, he will give a G code. LV will be activated and we eliminate in few minutes the problem with the ships. And this, I will take this opportunity to invite you to book your own webinar at Citizen, of course, free of charge to explain you what is LFV, the low frequency vibration, how it works and what are the benefits. We can also discuss with you your, product, your production and your workpiece. Uh, maybe also information, uh, statistic about LFV. We are selling LFV since the end of 2016. The first machines was delivered 2017, the Swiss type machines. And uh, today we have only in Europe 2,000, almost 2,000 machines running with LFV. And uh, why we have the NEX today here? Because our Cinco Miano customers was really wishing, pushing us to produce the LFV on a fixed head machine on the turret side. We are ready, we have the machine. At this point, I will say, now is your turn to ask me questions. I am not alone here. I am with Mr. Nagazawa, with Zasha, Oliver. We are ready for your questions. You can use the chat to drop some questions. Yes, we have a question. Thank you very much. Martin, thank you, Martin. Uh, the question is, when is delivery for the ANX starting? I will say the first ANX will arrive in June but we have already machines sold. It means the free machines will arrive September 
Yeah, the three machines uh, available are uh, del with the delivery of September. Of course, we have a very active market, so it's changing not every day, but every week we have a change and uh, yeah, your dealer can confirm uh, with the offer uh, the exactly delivery time and we can of course reserve the machine for you to check your financing and so on. But the machine is ready. The machine is here, the machine is working, the machine is working at customers in Japan. Uh, the first machine will come to Europe soon, in June. So I'm very happy that it's the shut is for is working. Okay, I I suggest that we will uh, handle the questions later on anyway, uh, after the presentation of the BNE. So I will move to the machine. See you in two seconds. <clears throat> okay. So welcome again. Again in Fillingendorf with the next machine. I'm here in the front of the BNE 65 MYY heavy duty Miano. We have here more power, but we are also fast. Um, the BNE machine incorporates the three key technology from Miano, which is the machine casting, the hand scripted uh, box slide ways, and the rigid spindle design. I will explain later the benefit of these three key technologies. And in addition, we have the fastest controller in the world. This is confirmed by Mitsubishi. We have the Meldas 850W. This is a very nice combination to have a rigid, heavy duty machine and with the fastest, fastest uh, cycle time. So of course we don't have the LFB function available, but what we have here is a high rigid guide box uh, sliding ways made by hand. As I mentioned, I will explain this uh, point again, but this giving the machine high rigidity and, and, and high precision. Here again, some turning process in parallel mode. You can see that the back spindle has enough stroke 155 to work without any limitation uh, for the back machining. We can share the cycle time between main spindle, back spindle. We can make inter interpolation of the axis. We can work together by milling. And uh, also important information for our Miano you, uh, customers, the turret system is the same like on our old BNE, like our BNG machine, like our BND machine. So basically we have three categories of turrets. The bigger one is for the ABX, and then the medium one is in the BNE generation, and the smaller one is in our uh, ANX and BNA 42 machines. So now the pickup process. Also for the part catcher, a standard is a basket, but uh, we modify it for uh, our customer also with the hand type. So the hand type also available option to pick up the part for example, when you are work, uh, producing very thin parts and having um, a pin to inside clamping. So you need a gripper to take the part out. And this is an option available as well. Good. Coming now to the uh, three key technology of Miano. Let me open the door first. Uh, here. So I come from this side. So starting with the casting. The casting of the Miano, also, avail also valid for the ANX, is made from one piece of metal, one casting. This is very important because one piece of metal is now in the machine uh, considered as a, as a platform. This pl platform is supporting all machine components. We have in this platform two spindle and two turrets. You know, bigger machines, you know, truly bigger machines are sens sensitive when opening the door for changing tooling, for example, the temperature is, is, is uh, uh, the machine is cooling down and uh, when you restart, the machine will move from the term thermical reasons. Because we have this uh, platform, the operator will close the door, will start the machine and will not see the difference because all the components are moving in the same direction. 
Yes. Uh, of course, citizen can also reduce the cost for the production and uh, build a casting from two, three pieces together, screwed together or by welding. This is uh, much, much lower from the cost, but we will have very negative effect and we will lose our Miano image about precision. Imagine you have now two castings. It means when you open the door, the upper turret will move left or right, you never know. And the other casting will move to the other direction. After closing the door, you have to warm up again the machine just for changing tooling. Losing 20 minutes for warm up is not productive. That's why citizens are keeping in this traditional one piece of casting production. Now coming to the hand scripted slide ways, I mentioned this is handmade and it is until today 100% handmade. This is metal over metal. We don't have any Teflon. It's just a little bit of oil for the sliding effect. We have what we see here from the Z axis, hardened grinded surface and the opposite side is casting hand script. Yeah, be surely you, sh you see it, a video, or if you visit our homepage also, uh, and, and check why Miano, you will find some pictures how our colleagues in Japan are making this scraping um, of, the, of the axis. And all the axis has the contact, not only from the top, but also from the side. So the guide are fully guide of this uh, uh, box system. Not every customer need precision, for sure. This is, this is not really, uh, uh, this is for the precision very important, but there is an effect what I need to mention, what is confirmed not by citizen test, but from our customers. The damping characteristic of this uh, box guides is so nice that customers reduce the cost of the tooling. We can increase the tool life three or four times higher by using the guide box. I will take also this opportunity to invite you to send us your drawing when having problems with the tool life and we will study and we will make you a test cut to show you the performance. Or we can visit our Miano customers, then you can discuss between customer and customer about this feature. This feature is something that nobody consider. We get sometimes the info, but I don't need too much precision, but tooling cost is a key point. Coming now to the third point, the spindle design. The Miano, all the Miano machines are built for the bar working. I mean not uh, one meter, I mean three meter and six meter bars. That's why the spindle design is made very rigid. We have thick wallet spindle with a large bearings. We have in the front a double angular bearing for the accuracy of the runout, and we have the cylinder bearing for absorbing the axial forces. Uh, what to mention also to the spindle, yes, the spindle mounted on all Miano machines are this quick change spindle. Means when the bearing are uh, getting old and need to be uh, changed, uh, no need uh, to ask an engineer to make it in your facility because this takes time and he cannot make it very professional uh, in the workshop. So we have a system for exchanging the spindle. It means the engineer from your dealer or citizen will came with the new spindle, will mount it in four hours, and you can restart your production. The old spindle will be come back to citizen as an exchange. We will make it uh, complete new and will going again to the stock. So we have this exchange system, which is uh, very good for the productivity for you to not block the machine too long. Now, moving to the controller. Um, you remember I mentioned that we have here the fastest controller in the world. Many of you hopefully know our Mitsubishi 700 controller, uh, which we uh, are using on our L12, L20, L32, also in the BNE51 MSY. The controller is very, very fast. The uh, M850 controller is faster. I explain why. The processing time of the PLC and the program reading is 1.7 times faster than Melda 700. This is also helping to reduce the idle time because everything will lead to an idle time. Cutting time is almost the same. Now our target citizen is to 
attack the idle time to reduce it to the maximum, together with Mitsubishi, of course. Then we have also the response time, communication between NC and amplifiers. Yeah? It's also some time losing by this communication. The M800 is three times faster than the 700. This will help us, additionally to the superimposed function, additionally to the prepared macros, to the compact kinematic, will help us to have a heavy duty machine, precision, and fast cycle time. A last point about the um, size of the machine and the weight. Now I am in front of uh, 8.2 tons uh, in a footprint of six square meter, 2.8 here, and the dip is two meter uh, point one. I forget to mention also the size of the ANX. You remember? You remember that the ANX all the performance I mentioned is really in a four square meter. Yeah, the machine has 2.6 length, the ANX, and 1.6 large. It's very, very compact. And remember, we have eight axes, and we have the X axis with 240 millimeter in the backside. And the ANX has a weight of 6.2 tons. Also, very heavy machine, giving stability. I hope I mentioned all the points. So I am satisfied. I hope you also. Now is your turn to ask questions. I have to come back to my screen to read your questions. So see you again in the next camera. Thank you very much. Ah, the wizard. The wizard, I guess, is not ready yet for the ANX, but our colleagues from UK are surely hardly working on this. But this will come soon. They are really fast with updating the wizard. So no doubt this will come. This is coming from Mr. Pereni. Thank you. Ah, yes, uh, Mr. Toth mentioned also, this is our customer from Hungary. Best regards to Hungary. Uh, no voice, no sound, but I think we solved it. Okay. Super, the next question. Ah, it's working again, perfect. Now it's okay, a la carte visa. Okay, so we get uh, a lot of message about the sound. Sorry, I don't know which, which uh, information was missing. Anyway, the video, uh, what we make now, we will, uh, we will make it uh, a little bit more compact. We will put it on our homepage and our video channel. You will see it uh, in complete, in full size and with the full um, sound. So I'm very happy to have uh, a lot of Sasha, can we tell how many people was uh, watching? Is interesting information for everybody? Almost 300. Oh, almost 300 customers and colleagues from all of Europe. Thank you very much. This is for us the biggest thanks from your side. So we will continue. After, we will have your feedback, of course, because we want to improve this kind of, uh, of events. As Mr. Isaac mentioned, we have not easy time I am missing the exhibition. I am missing to visit our customers. Me and my colleague, we are looking forward to visit you again in life, to invite you also. But uh, until this time, we will use this uh, tool to keep in touch with you and to give you our information al always as fast as possible. So I think uh, with the part from my side is finished. I say have a nice day, have a nice weekend, and I will be happy to get your feedback. Only like this we can improve ourselves. Bye-bye. All the best.